welcome to the ITU studio at the Plenipotentiary Conference 2018 in Dubai in the United Arab Emirates, where I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio this morning, Mr. Bruno Ramos, who is the Regional Director for ITU for the Americas region. Bruno, welcome to the studio. Thank you so much, Max. I'd like to catch up with you because the theme for this year's Plenipotentiary Conference is connecting the world together, as you know. I wanted to ask you, how has your region been making strides to get everyone connected over the last four years, since the last plenipotentiary conference? Listen, uh, in, in Americas, we have uh, very different regions. So we have uh, a sub-region that is uh, very developed and uh, other parts of the region that are not. So the, the, the point that the region is uh, focusing is uh, on developing the infrastructure, trying to get, uh, you know, uh, support and uh, also capacity to increase the infrastructure. So what we from the ITU uh, are doing to support the countries. First, trying to help them in develop new frameworks, new legal frameworks that will support in national base to you know increase the investments in the infrastructure so this is a very important part the second one is uh, try to to help them in the capacity building aspects just to create uh, a new, new people to support this so this is uh, there are two major points that we are doing there so trying to increase and uh, uh, bring uh, the service for everybody. So I think this is the two points. When members reach out to you at a conference like this, what, what, are, the, what are their major concerns? We have, uh, you know, a few points, uh, mainly in this uh, uh, plenipotentiary conference here, about uh, new aspects, new studies, uh, new activities for the Union for the next four years. I think also in Americas we had a lot of discussions in the preparation for the conference, mainly in uh, internet-related uh, aspects because of uh, the increase of the new services, new applications. And uh, even the part of the Americas region that uh, don't have uh, a lot of uh, uh, service providers or infrastructure providers, but uh, they are very active in the new applications and development of softwares, etc. So this is something that the region prepared a lot. So Americas uh, sent 54 contributions to the Plenipotentiary Conference. So it shows that Americas is very focused and put ITU in the highest priority in the country. So they are contributing a lot. And, and you've got a new uh, d director as well. Do you think that's going to, the, to change in terms of uh, the priorities of the, uh, um, of the region? Uh, you know, after being elected, w a person should work for all countries. But for sure, considering the, the basis that uh, after 12 years without any representative uh, from Americas. Uh, right now, Americas uh, have uh, two uh, elected officials. They are going to work for the all countries, for sure, but uh, they know very well the problems and maybe they can understand and try to help better the, the Americas region. Perhaps I could ask you, about ITU's plans for the next uh, few years uh, for the Americas region? Yes, for the next uh, three years. Uh, actually, uh, after the, the conference uh, last year in uh, Buenos Aires, the WTDC, World Telecommunication Development Conference, so the members approved the, the, what we have to do for the next four years. So. For 2019, just to give you some examples, uh, we are trying to provide in Americas a new pilot model. So we are concentrating the events because uh, in the past 
we had a lot of events. And the, for the countries to follow this, it's very difficult. So right now, the idea is to concentrate only in three weeks and divide the topics in the first week that will be in April on the innovation, new technologies, to think on the future. So we are going to concentrate all activities in this week. In August, we will have uh, a week on regulatory aspects and also in economics. So thinking about spectrum management, etc., etc. And in November, it's a big event that on uh, digital inclusion that will, uh, you know, in this discussion, we are going to not only persons with disabilities, it started with uh, persons with disabilities, an event exclusively for persons with disabilities, but right now we are increasing to talk about gender, to talk about persons in a vulnerable situation, uh, children, also indigenous people. So the idea for the next year is try to concentrate and try to give the countries the idea that uh, they can focus in only three weeks and not having a lot of events. They don't have a lot of money to participate. So we are going to have this pilot next year. So I think it will be very good for the region to concentrate in, uh, in these activities. What about the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals? Are they playing a part in your plans and activities? For sure. I think it's uh, our goal. Because, uh, as I said, during this WTDC 17 in Buenos Aires, all the objectives and also the outputs that are services and products that we, as Secretariat, we provide to the countries, so are based in the implementation of SDGs. So, and also we have a very nice table that you can find in the ITU website, uh, linking the objectives of developing countries and also the implementation of SDGs. So I think it's, uh, it's uh, our job objective and we are going to focus on this in the next years. Makes very clear links to it, I'm sure. And finally, do you have a message for participants here at, uh, at the ITU Plenipotentiary Conference and also to our wider audience as well? Yes, I think uh, all conferences of the Union, but mainly the Plenipotentiary Conference, is an opportunity to people to work together. I think this is the most important thing. We know that uh, in our world today we have different views. But uh, we must think that uh, we are living together in the same planet. So we need to try and also I think that members here are doing that. So work together in order to have a better life for everybody. Bruno Ramos, thank you very much indeed. Okay, thank you Max thank for you. the opportunity. Thank you.